everyone, welcome to Toffee Tube. My name is Toffee, and today on Toffee Tube, we're going to be discussing the Squid Game Custom Design Review. The Squid Game series became one of the most popular broadcasts so far in a very short time. An intriguing story that left the audience speechless and the games that appealed to all viewers. Maybe at the beginning of the series, none of us thought we were going to face something like this. But from the very first episode, it caught everyone's attention and was very successful. One of the significant factors that itself influenced the success of this series was its custom design. You may ask yourself how? They were just a bunch of tracksuits. I recommend you to watch this video till the end to find out why and how. Please stay with me and make sure to hit the subscribe button if you haven't already because I will put further parts of the review in this channel so click the notification bell so you don't miss out on future uploads. Without wasting time, I want to start talking about the outfits. The first group is the contestants that are seen in green tracksuits. Green tracksuits with white side stripes on the shoulder and the pants. In the left corner of the tracksuits, the number of each participant is announced and they wore a simple white raglan t-shirt with a green collar and sleeves under it. Like the tracksuit, the number of each participant is printed on it. They completed this outfit with white slip-on dance shoes. First of all, I must say that this outfit is not a representation of being classy or fashionable. As it happens, in the customs of this series, you should look more for the concept behind it than for its fashion point of view. If we disregard the scenes related to the gyms or sports activities, in recent years in the most K-dramas, tracksuits are generally a symbol of non-rich and successful people who are looking for a solution to their issues and avoid from counted as a loser. Except for this guy. In the Squid Game series, this fact is well observed. Participants who enter a game land to escape the misery of their lives and to make a revolution happen all have to wear uniforms. The color of this tracksuit is green. I can say that it was the best choice for several reasons. Green symbolizes peace, friendship, honesty, mental health, prosperity, and freshness. Along the way, the story proves to you that they do not have any of these characteristics. At first, it may have been showcased that these participants were called to the game with respect and open arms. But game after game, we realized that this was not an ordinary childish game. And this is the farthest thing that could have symbolized the green color. The next reason that green can be said to be the right choice for these outfits is the contrast with red. Where the massacre takes place in the scenes, you can see the best videotaped images of the blood spilled on the clothes. In fact, this color was the best choice to form such a contrast. Another reason for choosing this color is the director himself, who claimed that he was inspired by the uniforms of his own school gym in the 70s of South Korea. An interesting example that has been mentioned many times is the very similarity of this outfit to Kim So Hyun's costume in the Secretly Greatly movie, where he disguised as an everyday guy in a poor neighborhood. The next group in this land is the workers. <laughs> Their costume is a pink jumpsuit with envelope pockets on the sides of the pants and on the upper left side of the bodies. The jumpsuit has a hood that they pull it over their head and also has a front zipper that gets pulled upwards. The waist is fastened with a black fabric belt and is a good option to hold some small arms. The design of this outfit is more focused on its functionality. The pockets in different sizes indicates that the purpose is to carry weapons and related stuff. Cooking was also done with these clothes, but of course, it can be assured that also those cooks were armed like others. At first glance, these outfits may look red, but these are all pink. The most important symbol that can be attributed to pink, whether it is hot or light, is purity, which has nothing to do with these workers. In fact, we saw the utmost cruelty in them. It was as if they had trained enough to be so cruel, or perhaps they had been brainwashed. The use of a combination of pink and black well contrasted with the green and white that the participants wore. All workers enter with their faces covered. The masks that these people use have square, triangle, and circle symbols. The director claimed that he did this because of his interest in the PlayStation's console and did not use the cross sign because he did not like the Xbox symbol. This is not the first time the signs of the PlayStation have been used as inspiration or promotional items. An interesting example I can give is the time of the launch of the PlayStation 5 in which Sony partnered with London Transport, in which the underground symbols of the Oxford station were shaped like the four main PlayStation buttons, which was a very interesting idea. In this series, each of these shapes expresses the level of that worker. Circle masks are for workers who are mostly responsible for cleaning the dead, cooking, or the primary responsibilities. 
The triangle is for armed soldiers who can shoot. They also wear black suspender in addition to carrying weapons. And the square is for commanders. In fact, this sample is an inspiration to the life of ants. As they have workers and must take care of the home, and their leader is the queen, and they all have a colony life. The line implemented on the mask makes them look more like ants. And of course, this model is very similar to the fencing uniform. This is not the only mask on the face of workers. All of them use another black mask under this one that covers all parts of the face except the eyes. And this is because they're more conservative regarding their identity. All workers have a duty to be present at work with the same outfit completely covering the face, which is why one of the workers was killed immediately when a mask was removed from his face in a scene. But this rule did not necessarily apply to contestants. They usually wore their full outfits and often appeared in t-shirts. The last one is the superior of all these people. That is the frontman. He wears a black jacket that is a different and such formal outfit compared to the other two categories. However, it also has a hood with large pockets for carrying weapons. The cuts and stitches in the front part of the costume is neatly done and well shaped. By watching this outfit, you feel a sense of quality from the costume and buzz from that person. Given the green and pink colors worn by guards and participants, black was the best choice to cover someone who was considered the leader of them all. A neutral color that created balance. His leather gloves are also among the strong points in his style. The most important icon in the frontman's look is his mask. The hard edges on the mask turn him into a humanoid sculpture, so that you're sure that this is not a human being. On the other hand, you get a sense of being real from it. It is kind of designed to instill a negative feeling in the viewer. The light reflections that are created at different angles on the mask make you look at it differently from every angle. In the series, it can be seen that this mask is designed in such a way that it even has the face recognition potential, so this is not a normal mask at all. Masks are one of the most iconic accessories used in Squid Game. In the last episodes, we see luxury masks made of gold that covers the faces of the main leaders of this land. These people are actually the richest and most influential people in the world and each of them gathers together in the final game with masks that are shown as the face of the animals. These animals include lion, tiger, bull, bear, deer, and owl. Each of these animals, according to the symbol they have, somehow expresses the level and degree of that person. In South Korea, the lion is a symbol of guarding against disasters, so it is expected that the one who wears the golden mask of the lion will be a powerful leader who is superior to the rest. The tiger is the national animal in South Korea and is mentioned in many myths and legends, so we can expect that the person wearing the golden tiger mask is probably their cultural leader or has some kind of higher level than the others. Also in Korean culture, the bull is usually considered the ox, one of its main symbols of which is unity and stubbornness, so it is possible that the person wearing the golden bull mask is a tougher leader than the others. Also, the beer is a symbol of patience and holiness at the same time, so it is possible that the person wearing the golden bear mask is a wiser leader than the others. The deer is a divine animal and is a kind of representative of God on earth. This may mean that the person wearing the gold deer mask is a more religious leader than the others. The point of this story is that all these animals in their meaning express positive definitions of spirit and humanity. But in fact, all those who wore those golden surreal masks depicting these animals had the exact opposite behavior of what they should be. Perhaps the only person who could not be said to have used the mask in the opposite sense was Ilnam, who used the golden owl mask. The owl is a symbol of intelligence and ingenuity, which was proved to us about him along the way. In general, I can say that in the costume design of this series, more attempts have been made to create contradictions, and I believe that they were very successful in this field. Now we have to see what new outfits we may watch in the next season, so make sure to subscribe to this channel to be informed about future uploads. Well, that's it for today. I'd be so glad to know what is your opinion. Do you think this costume design is strong? Which one was the best? Please let me know in the comments. Stay notified, this channel includes many reviews and analyses. Don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to see more content like this. So, see you soon.